as a graduate uh, of Carnegie Mellon in chemistry, I went to graduate school for chemistry and I thought I would have a career path that stayed in chemistry. But I ended up discovering that I really enjoyed not just one area of science, but a lot of areas of science, and I really enjoyed writing about science. And so I ended up with a career now that I describe as being science communications. So it started out as science writing and media relations, translating technical information for a general audience. And now I help explain scientific concepts to still a pretty broad audience, but they're all scientists. I'm often asked, since I'm a science communicator, whether I would do anything differently. I had four years of chemistry as an undergraduate at Carnegie Mellon. I was in graduate school for chemistry for five years and earned my PhD. And so that's a lot of chemistry education to not be a chemist or not be a researcher. But in fact, it is the right underpinning for everything I've done since then. And it, it all helped me get to where I've been and where I am now. I have always written about science and understanding science from, from being within, from being a student of science, has helped me understand what the options are for researchers in their own fields, even if I don't know the details of those fields. So I wouldn't do anything differently.